good citizenship are inseparable. They are both synonymous. That is, both go in tandem. Pari Pasu. Tell your neighbor, whatever make men go Christians, make them go citizens. Tell your neighbor once again. Yes, I'm a Christian. I'm not a religious man. Striving against people and standing on the people and speaking against others. We are fighting on battle. We are to battle the spiritual entities that cause tension, killing, stealing, and destruction. We are not fighting this physical appearance that we are seeing. Our battle is not against flesh and blood. The gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ is the good news. The message is righteousness. When you hear it, it gladdens your heart. We have the ability to preach. This must make it happen in the person of Holy Ghost. Tell your neighbor, apply yourself to your work, to your duty as a Christian soldier. It is not the physical appearance that is our enemy. We are not fighting the physical appearance we are seeing. If you are not armed, for battle, you will fight the wrong battle. Can you tell your neighbor if you are not armed for battle, you will fight the wrong battle? If we are not armed for battle, we will not be able to listen to the inner voice of the Holy Spirit. to be stay steady look at what the Bible says in that book of 1st Timothy it says Paul 1 Timothy not to take a step back when he is sick, when he is attacked, when he is persecuted, he wants him not to take a step back. When he is sick, when he is persecuted, when he is discouraged, not to take a step back. But what is happening to you today? And remember, what is good for Timothy, equally good for us, is warning us not to take a step back while we are facing persecution. When we are facing crisis, not to take what? A step back. Because persecution, whatever you call it, and men for our spiritual benefits.
The problem of believing is made easy if we know that it is acting on what God has spoken. The Spirit makes us know that believing is possessing. The instant you believe, you have. It is yours. With the heart, man believes that Jesus is righteousness. Jesus is Savior. Jesus is healer. Deliverer with the heart, not mouth. If your heart is empty and your spirit is, there will be nothing for the spirit to act on. Our spirit acts upon the way. The more you think about what you read, the more your spirit acts upon the way. Living in the way, the word of God, in times of trial and temptation, will assist us to respond by the Holy Spirit. We talk about our battle instead of the one who is fighting for us. We respond to reason instead of the word of God. If there's anything we have faith in today, it is in man what man has done. Science works organization today people talk about their Tao instead of their faith people focus on their enemy instead of their comforter when you obey the word that is spoken by the holy spirit in times of conflict and suffering you grow and mature the only spirit is our comforter, defender, redeemer. You must obey the word that is spoken by the Holy Spirit. is coming. Tell your neighbor, when your situation remind you of God, know that promotion is coming. This is what I mean by our situation is made for our spiritual benefit. Our situation produces a sense of depending on God. When you have situation, headache, or doctor say to you, Whoa, this is serious, this is cancer, this is cancer, this is liver, and this reminds you immediately of God, knowing that promotion is coming. It's not meant to destroy you, but to improve you, your relationship with God. 